Hi, welcome to our video on removing a jam from the E2 printer. Before we get started, you will need a 2mm hex wrench, a Phillips screwdriver, a pair of pliers, and a nozzle clean rod. Okay, let's get started. First, go to the Utilities page, select Filament Loader, and select Unload. Wait for the hot end to reach the correct temperature and click Unload. Then, insert the nozzle clearing rod from the accessory box into the feeding entrance to determine where the jam is located. If you can push the filament out of the nozzle, please continue reading this tutorial. Power off the printer, remove the front fan cover with a 2mm hex wrench. There is one screw on the side and one on the front. Remove the front fan with a 2mm hex wrench. There are two screws along the top. Remove the gear cover with a 2mm hex wrench. Remove the big gear, being careful not to loosen the bearing around the shaft. If there is any filament melted in this section, it may be more difficult to remove that big gear. After removing the big gear, check if there is any filament accumulated there. If so, please use a pair of pliers to remove it. If not, or if the filament isn't melted, it may be stuck in the hot end. Please continue to the next step. If there's filament going through the extruder assembly to the hot end, or the clearing rod stopped at the hot end, you can remove the hot end to clear the jam. Loosen the screw that secures the hot end with the 2mm hex wrench, and grab the hot end with a pair of pliers and pull it straight down. If the filament is stuck in the hot end, please manually unscrew the cap on the throat tube, remove the cap and the Teflon tube, and try to pull out the filament to remove the jam. Heat up the hot end to a temperature that is a bit cooler than its melting temperature corresponding to the filament. For example, set to 220 degrees Celsius if the filament would be melted at 250 degrees Celsius and wait for the hot end to reach the set temperature. Pull out the filament with a pair of pliers and use a nozzle cleaning rod to clean thoroughly. Please note, the hot end is extremely hot now. Be careful to avoid burns. You can wear the heat resistant gloves included in the accessory box. After removing the jam, please reinstall all components to the printer. Click the setting icon at the upper right corner of the screen then click Machine, Maintenance, Offset Calibration in this sequence to recalibrate the distance between the nozzle and the printing surface. Okay, that's it. Thanks for watching our video. If you have any trouble removing the jam, please contact our support staff 